Now to a story that we've been following since our morning newscasts. A man shot and killed during a robbery in the Sunnyside area. Now a friend of that man who was also a victim in the attack is talking about the tense moments. This happened in the area of Reed and Scott Street and Town 2's Kathy Hernandez has the latest. The woman who was driving that car says the victim is a friend, a veteran, and a father of three. This afternoon, she's devastated, questioning why the robbers would open fire after they already had what they wanted. They told me to give, me, give them everything I had, and they had a gun in my face. They waved the gun in my face. They the woman on the left everything. was the driver of this car, where her 41-year-old friend was shot and killed. And I was scared for my life. So scared now to show her face. Police say that woman, the victim, and two others were sitting in the car in the parking lot of Cloverland Park on Hickok and Scott Tuesday morning. My friend had to use the restroom as we proceed to go home. The woman says two men wearing masks and hoodies walked up, put a gun to her face and asked for her belongings. She quickly gave up her purse. But as the two men were walking away, she says they shot at least once inside the car. If I give you my purse, why would you fire back at me? If you already have what you want, why would you take what, what, a give what you want? Life. Take, why? Take, take, take a person's life. Then the woman drove to the shopping center on Reed near Scott for help. When he got shot, he, he gasped for his L. And I didn't even know he had been shot till I pulled up over here at the scenery where we're at. That man died at the scene. As investigators work desperately to determine who the gunman was and why he pulled the trigger. It's a possibility that, yeah, there was just a crime of opportunity because, you know, the individuals, uh, they're just friends hanging out. Friends want justice. I just, I just pray to God that they find the people that did that because my friend was a good person. Right now, police can only tell us those two robbers got away in a black SUV. If you have any information about who they may be, please call police. As for the victim, they have not yet released his identity. Reporting in Sunnyside, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.